As we continue our celebration of Women's History Month here at KTAB, tonight we highlight an Abilene woman who has helped shape the Abilene community. KTAB's Claire Kreitz has her story. Honestly, if they gave out Superwoman Awards, I'd nominate her for sure. Dedicating more than three decades to the tourism industry. Because she tells her story and tells it in such a way that people want to come see us, we have just throngs of people at our doorstep all the time. Nancy Lyles has made Abilene the city it is today. She's a phenomenal economic power for Abilene. Making hospitality and tourism one of the top three biggest economic drivers for the key city, being one of the first women to serve as chairperson of the Texas Travel Industry Association, and receiving countless state awards for bringing people into the area. These just scratch the surface of Lyle's 34-year career with the Abilene Convention and Visitors Bureau. And I've been told by multiple people across the state at other convention and visitors bureaus that they wonder if Abilene really knows what they have in Nancy Lyles. Such a successful career, however, doesn't come without its challenges. You always face challenges, I think, as a woman, especially uh, when you're in state leadership. Uh, they're run by men, typically. But these challenges, pushing her to help open the doors for future generations. Women have a great perspective on many different things. And a lot of times, even in today's world, um, most of the people at the table are men. She will help you, she will put opportunities in front of you, and she will champion other women to anyone who will listen. And she's nothing short of an inspiration to not only the women following in her footsteps, but even those who came before her. In Abilene, with coverage you can count on, Claire Kreitz, KTAB News. Thank you, Claire. Uh, to see more inspiring stories featuring local women, visit the KTAB website, bigcountryhomepage.com.